Welcome back to another video on Animal HK. In this video, we will be looking at the Hong Kong Rabbit Society. As the name suggests, this is a um, organization that helps rabbits in Hong Kong. And given that 53% of my viewers and subscriptions come from Hong Kong, I decided I'd take a look at this. This organization helps rabbits get adopted and also sells hay and many other things. Um, they are a non-profit, which means they don't earn any money. So they rely mainly on volunteers. Here we are at their website. Uh, what we're going to look at is adoption right here. The reason why we're looking at this is so that we can have a look at some of the rabbits which are actually there for adoption to see if we can. Up here you can see cancelled cases. So let's press on that. These are all the rabbits that didn't get adopted. Here we have a rabbit. So these are the ones that got cancelled for adoption, I'm pretty sure. The rabbit name is Chantele, breed mixed dwarf rabbit. It's three months old, similar to my rabbit, and passed away because of sudden collapse during hospitalization for surgery. So this rabbit died during surgery, unfortunately. Let's look at homing cases. I think these are the ones that we can actually adopt. And many of these rabbits will have many health issues, which is very sad. So this one is called Tickle. It is a mixed dwarf rabbit, gray and white, and is 4.5 years old and is male. Um, I'm not sure if these rabbits are like neutered so they don't reproduce, but I'm pretty sure they are. So now let's look at another one. How about, let's look at radish here. This is radish. Its breed is a domestic. Name is radish, 3.5 years old. And here, other remarks. This rabbit has pasturella and teeth problems. So that means, actually, if they have a teeth issue, the teeth and eye system are connected. So this rabbit could also get an eye infection if it has a teeth infection. About 60% of the rabbits, I'd say, have a health issue. Here we have chestnut. Name, chestnut, breed, Angora. Haven't heard of that one. Six years old, male. This rabbit has an eye, brain, and spinal problem. As you can see right here. Eye, brain, and spinal problem. And the reason why this is a problem is because, number one, it's causing the rabbit foundation a lot of money to take care and surgery on them. And people won't adopt it because they might not be able to afford it. Here's another example with Jason. It has a teeth, eye, spinal, and tear duct problem. Many of these rabbits will have this. So let's go to the next page. Let's look at 11. This is 11. L11, yeah. He is a lion head, brown and white, female. Oh, she is a female, 2.5 years old. This rabbit has a teeth problem. Let's look at one more rabbit before I close the video. Let's look at Otis. Here's Otis. It is a he, a male, black and white. Breed is a lop, L-O-P. And again, he has a teeth problem, tear duct, liver, and heart problem. They also list the personality, which I think is really cool. Gentle and approachable. Very cute rabbits. Before we end this video, I want to show you one more thing. If you look up here, there are different sections, but here is donation. So even if you don't live in Hong Kong, you could donate to them. I'll make sure to leave their website link in the description. But until then, thank you very much for watching. And... I hope you have opportunity to look at this website. Once again, link in the description. And hope you also get a chance to donate.
So thanks for watching. Bye.